Welcome back. In this tutorial, we're going to be learning about solid history. In AutoCAD, we've got the ability to record a solid's history. In other words, we can view the steps by which the solid was created. To activate solid history, type in solid hist. AutoCAD fills in some suggestions. Let's press Enter to activate the tool. Now AutoCAD asks us to enter a new value for solid hist. We've got two options, 0 and 1. It works like this. If the value set to 0, the history will not be recorded. When the value set to 1, the history of the composite solid is going to be retained. So if you want to record that history, you enter 1 and press Enter to accept. OK, let's create some solids. I'll drop a box about here. Now a cylinder. And let's snap to this corner. Oh, we need to toggle snap mode on. OK, snap to this corner for our center point, base radius, and height. Now let's activate solid subtract. First, pick the solid to subtract from. Next, the object to subtract. If I want to view the cylinder, just press down the control key and hover over it. I'm able to change its parameters as well. To exit, press Escape. I can also select my solid. Let's expand the Properties panel. Turn Show History on. And here we see how our solid was created. Let's drop in some more geometry, a box. Ensure Snap is toggled on. And let's snap my cone center point here. Solid Subtract. Object to subtract from, right click. Object to subtract, right click to execute. To show the history for all solids, type in Show Hist and press Enter. We've got three options here 0, 1, and 2. Let me explain what those mean. 0 will hide all histories. If you choose 1, you don't override the individual Show History property setting for the solid. If you choose 2, you'll show the history for all solids, and you override the individual Show History property for all solids. Let's enter 2 and press Enter. Now we can see in model space how both solids were created. This concludes our tutorial about solid history.